Hi, everybody, and welcome back to another Dollar Tree Haul with me, Margo. I do want to mention that the 300 subscriber winner, I have not heard from you yet, and that is Garla's DIY. Um, if I don't hear from you by Friday, Garla, I will uh, pick another name. But I do want to give you the opportunity to receive your prize. So, again, please contact me. Uh, either by email or Instagram, and I will put that information in the description below, and I will send you your package. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and also share. I do appreciate all the subscribers I do have now. You guys seem to be pretty dedicated. I hear from a lot of yous all the time, and it's that's a great feeling. It's awesome. Um, I mean, I hear other YouTubers, like they say it all the time, but I'm feeling it now. So you guys are like a family to me. All right, so let's get started. This is not a very big Dollar Tree haul, but it is a Dollar Tree haul. So let me get started. So I did find these, the Palmolive uh, Spray Away. So many people are looking for these. It does work well, I've tried it. It works well. I don't care for the scent. It's pretty strong, but I'll get over that because it does work well. So I, I picked up actually three of them, and I have two here and one I've already used. Okay, and then I found this blue raspberry craft sodas, and sorry, I don't have things in category today. Uh, so I figured I would get this for my son to try it's a pretty cool bottle i like it and then i picked this up this propel my husband likes this i don't really care for flavored waters myself i prefer just plain water i know a lot of people that do like the flavored waters though then my son was with me and he picked this up this hawaiian punch this is definitely a repeat buy for him. He, yeah, he really likes that stuff. And he also grabbed this Snapple Apple. And let's see, I did get, oops, before this falls, I picked up these combos for my husband. He takes um, snacks to work with him. Um, all the time and with his lunch he's a um, a driver so he's not sure where he's going to be and this is uh, best before 2 2023 and this is let's see three ounces I'm not sure if a dollar 25 is a good price for that I'll be honest with you I am not sure okay and let me get this other snack over here that my son picked up. And this is the Drizzlicious Birthday Cake Bites. And these are rice cakes. I have tried these. They are good. They are. And this is, let's see, uh, Best Buy October 4th, 2022. And it's a 1.5 ounce bag. Here's the nutritional facts on this. Oh, and this says only 90 calories per 21 pieces with chia. I think I'm saying that right. Uh, quinoa and flax. Oh, wow. It's actually um, healthy. Nice. Okay, so I think that is it for... Oh, no, we have a little bit of food right here. All right. So my son picked this up, the Hawaiian Bowl Loma, Loma Lunda, Linda, Loma Linda. And this is 360 calories for the whole pouch. It's with pineapple and brown rice ready in 60 seconds and this is a 10 ounce bag and the best buy date on this 
is August 3rd, 2022. Not too much longer. And then he picked up this one, which is the Greek bowl with chickpeas, olive oil, and brown rice. And again, 10 ounces and ready in 60 seconds. And the best buy date on this one is December 18th, 2022. And here are the nutritional facts on this one. There's 12 grams of protein in here, no GMO and gluten free. Nice. And then I picked this up, uh, chicken flavor rice sides by Noor. It's, it's probably the same price at Walmart or any grocery store for that matter. And this is a 5.6 ounce. And where's the best buy date on this? Okay, I don't see it. Nope. And it says it cooks in seven minutes. Okay, I think that is it for food. Food and drinks. I did find this. I was happy to see this. I hope it works. This is personal care insect repellent. Plant-based repellent. Repels mosquitoes. Lasts up to two hours. It's DEET free so that's actually better for the kids i just don't know how well it will work though without the deet but um my husband usually has a little one in his um uh, gym bag so when he goes to play sports and stuff like that this is a three fluid ounce we'll see he'll try it well, as I said, my son was with me and he picked these two things up. There's two five by sevens, plastic, and it holds on the, uh, sits on the table. So he had two five by sevens and one four by six. I don't think he's using these for photos. He told me what he was using them for, but I forgot. And then I found the ice trays. I had picked up the white ones, and I really, really like them. So I picked up two of the blue ones. So I'm going to replace all of my old ice trays with this kind. I really like these. You open it up, you fill it, close this back up, freeze it. There's no mess. I really like these a lot. Very happy that I found them and I did try them. Um, I found this 32 ounce of rocks, so two pounds of rocks for $1.25. That's awesome. That is awesome. And these are so nice. They're decorative. Um, I did get two of these. I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do with these, but I'll probably end up putting them like in the bottom of a vase or something and maybe with a floating candle on top. I don't know, we'll see. We will see. And my son needed one of these. He bought an, a little rug to put up in his room. And um, so I got him this to put underneath it so it doesn't slide all over the place. This is an 18 by 24 non-slip rug underlay. And this is a Greenbrier product. So everybody should have these. So we'll give that a whirl. And then I am making um, frames with names and stuff with the little tiles. And a family that I'm doing it for really loves music. So I want to attach this to it. That's going to be um, a Christmas gift. So I'm not sure exactly when I'm going to do this craft, but... Um, hopefully, I film it for one of my DIYs. As you know, I want to uh, change my decor in the kitchen to bees. So, I did, um, I found a lot of the, the, the dishes and, let's see, the oven mitt. But I'm still looking for the pot holders 
and one more drying mat. I just really love this pattern. I wasn't always into bees. As a matter of fact, I really love ladybugs. Um, but I really like these bees. There's just something about these. But yeah, long story for that. <laughs> I found one more of these. Um, I had purchased one and given it to my sister. And, and then I thought to myself, wow, these are really cool. I can, I can use these in a craft or something. So I was glad when I found this. And I, again, with the nail polish. So, again, the China Glaze. So, this one is, um, it's glitter anyways. It looks like a purple or pink tint to it. And shine something. Oh, goodness, I can't see that. Okay, so anyways, let me tell you a story. I'm at the store, and now they're displayed like this in a box, just like this. Okay, so, and I have purchased these in the past for three. So the UPC, um, I guess there isn't one on this. Oh, yes, there is. No, no, there isn't one on this box. So she was scanning them individually and I saw that it was ringing 125 and I said, um, I believe these are supposed to be sold in the three pack. And she said, oh yes, they're coming up three for 125, but she was ringing them up individually. Anyways, I got these 125 for the three. So that's one of them. That's the, um, like I said, like a pink purple glitter. And this one is green and gold glitter. And this one has, oh, you know what I think? I have this one. This one has Oscar the Grouch on it. Maybe I did haul this one. And then I found this one. Oh, no, maybe not. Well, here's Cookie Monster. Here's another glitter. Three pack. I love these three packs. And then the last one, and that's another thing. She's ripping open the bottom. <laughs> um, this one is, this is a gold glitter. So I don't know if you guys remember um, the star, the moon, and the cloud that... Um, Dollar Tree was carrying their ceramic. I bought them in white. So I am going to do a DIY with nail polish and I'm going to paint those items. Okay, so I found this. Very happy to find this. They had probably eight out of the 12 um, astrology signs. And this is me, Scorpio. So I purchased this one. Uh, one of my sisters was with me and she purchased her, her sign. I, it's beautiful. I think it's absolutely beautiful. I'd like to have it open like this and maybe display it somewhere. There's um, ones that I saw. I think I'm going to get them. But there's green, purple, and black, I think. I want the green and the purple. There's like gems here. There's um, glitter. They're beautiful. They remind me of a peacock's tail. So I was thinking about taking the green one and the purple one and kind of, I don't know, put one on top of the other. I'm going to try it. Watch, I'm going to be looking for them and I won't find them. But anyways, I did purchase this one um, because it is my sign and I love the colors in it. I absolutely love the colors. Looks like a galaxy. Okay, so then this is a repurchase. Um, this Chapstick Total Hydration. These are expensive. Look them up in Walmart. Um, but I love this stuff. I bought the um scrub brush or pad it's kind of like a padded um rubber something or other anyways you use it for <laughs> the uh lip scrub 
Oh my, I love this stuff. Love it, love it, love it. <clears throat> oh, here's another uh, nail polish. And this one is NYC New York Color by Cody. And this one is the NYC In A Minute. This is a quick dry. I tried the Sally Hansen Insta Dry. That stuff is fabulous. Um, I haven't tried this one yet, but um, it was either this one or Sally Hansen. I can't quite remember. One of them was $8 a bottle. That's crazy. The Sally Hansen one, the Insta Dry, it's, it is a smaller bottle. It's rectangular, but that stuff is awesome. I used one coat and it does dry quick. So I'll let you know about this one. Okay, and then I, I bought this mushroom because I want to um, repaint the top of it. I don't know if I'm going to redo this part, but I definitely want to redo this part. And I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet, but I'm probably going to use nail polish. And I found this, of course, the bees. And I can't quite remember who I saw doing this, but great idea. I'm going to do it. They took a black Sharpie, went around the whole B, and then colored like every other um, line in black. And I think they added eyes to it. But what a great idea. I'm like, oh, that's awesome. I'm going to do the same thing. The Bs stand out more. So there's two Bs on here that I'll do that with. So very cute. And we needed nail polish remover, so I picked this up. Probably not the best price, $1.25, and this is six fluid ounce. It's 100% acetone. Because I paint now with the um, nail polish, this does work good on uh, fixing my mistakes. Okay, so the last four items are the um, tote bags the patriotic tote bags. So this one says American vibes with the peace sign and the side is blue. You guys know I love these tote bags. I love them. Um, so I did get one of each. There was four, four different ones. So this one is land of the free because of the brave. Love the stars on it. And these are also red on the side. My husband hasn't seen these yet, but I'm sure he's going to like them. And then United We Stand. This one has the blue handle and the blue sides. I really like this one. This one's probably my favorite. And then, I don't know, there's, they're all nice, but... And then the gnomes, of course. And this one also has the red side. I picked one of these up for um, my sister, the, the gnome fanatic. So yeah, that is it for this Dollar Tree haul. What I spent was $55. What it would have cost me somewhere else is around $127.23. And that's a big difference of $72.23. And again, that's why I love Dollar Tree. Thanks, guys. And hope you guys have a fabulous few days. I should be filming sometime at the end of this week. So I will see you guys then. Take care. Love you. Bye.